lost freedom because of what happened on September 11, 201, that led us into Afghanistan to invade a people when it could have been solved in a different way. When we make peace instead of war, oh, I want to be in that number. When we make peace instead of war. So the question war, is, how long will we play that and game? And be the cheerleaders for those who roll the dice, not only for the lives of the people in this country that go fight and die, but for the people in those lands that are seen as collateral damage. could have been solved in a humanitarian way. Criminally, it could have been solved. But instead, we go in and kill hundreds of thousands of For people. I killed my share of Indians in a thousand different parts. I was there at the little big hole. I saw many men lying. I saw many more dying. But I Anymore. But one thing that's different is the anniversary for us who understands war. We had a protest prior to the invasion of Afghanistan. That tomorrow is the anniversary of the day that Afghanistan was invaded by the U.S. Now look at what we've done with our bombs and guns. Tell me, is it worth We must it do all? this to preserve those freedoms. We lost freedoms not long ago with the national Defense Authorization Act. This is a struggle. And we've been struggling ever since the ships landed and stole the lands from the indigenous people here. And yet, we accept the fact that the people that come across from Mexico are the illegal aliens. But those who came in 1492 were the illegal aliens. And brought a government that oppresses people all over the world in an orchestrated manner. These violent acts have been taken against people who are only out in a peaceful way expressing their desire and I for change. Had a lovely dream. I saw a big parade with ticker tape galore and men were marching there the like I've never seen before. Do we continue to accept the lesser of two evil? The time has come when we here in this country will take a bold stand against what our government is doing Members to us. CEOs are going in the army. It seemed too bad to keep them from the wars they love to plan. We're all of us contented that they'll fight a dandy war. Oh, oh, we hate to see them go. The gentlemen of distinction in the army. 
there were Israeli soldiers everywhere. Young men with their hands on the bag and the trigger. We shall overcome someday. We are not afraid. Jerusalem and the West Bank, there were Israeli soldiers everywhere. Young men with their hands on automatic on the trigger of automatic. We are not afraid. Today.